Well, I haven't seen you before. Reg, man, they got a small army up here. Good. I mean, they're in the right place. Or that they really don't like other people playing with their stuff. Come on, focus, Delson. Do you see any way to take down the communications? Yeah, yeah, there's this, uh, anchor. Looks like it's holding all the antennas in place. I hope Reggie's got a good view of this. Anchors away. Nothing, sir. You? Nothing outside our immediate area. Yeah, Reg. Let's go find us some prime conduits and get some new powers. We own the streets! Take it easy. A few streets. In the immediate vicinity. All right? The DUP still owns the other 98%. But we kicked them off the space needle, man! You knocked out their comm center, okay? They may be deaf, but they're not dumb. Kicking the DUP completely out of Seattle is going to take time. We just got here. Who the hell is that? That's not one of the three who escaped. telling you it's gonna work. All right, they just found a body at Fifth and Briar. Go check it out, but promise me you'll be inconspicuous. Yeah. Because they've been trained to. Or maybe it's because they kill people. And maybe that's because sometimes they're given no other choice. Holy sh Holy what? What holy? Delson, are you okay? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Don't impale me. I come Be in careful. peace. careful. Real original advice. Whoa, whoa, hold your fire, or whatever the hell that is. It's okay, it's okay, I'm one of you. I mean, one of us. Would you slow down? I'm not gonna hurt you! Especially if you don't slow down. Stop! Come back! Great. Nice meeting you. You get him? No, he ran fast, like like really, really fast. Conduit fast, man. Screwed flesh eating dead days. I want that. Don't be greedy. Funny thing, man. I just before every shot, you could see the neon sign behind him dim a little. God, he must be a power source. Uh, head back to the sign. See what you can find. Good news is less juice for her. Bad news, I am not a night person. Do you keep bastard? Well. Maybe stop trying to kill me, and we can let the beer signs live to see another day. 
My call. Not yours, not ours, mine. Oh, really? So Mr. Freewheeling Badass finally wants to take on some responsibility. And for what, huh? A bioterrorist with a body count? I love you, Reds. Don't make me break that handsome nose of yours. Bye. She kills someone's father tomorrow, or mother the day after that. You're the one that allowed that to happen. You calm down. Yeah. Let's talk. So what's the plan? Uh, get him? Get him isn't a plan. I had that covered, you know. DOP bastard! All right, all done here. that camera. I got something for the viewers at home. Please. Please don't hurt me. Hello, America. My name is Abigail Walker, but my friends and enemies call me Fetch. Two things you should know about me. One, I'm a Pisces. Two, I've never hurt an innocent person in my life. <laughs> think I'm a monster, but it's not my fault. People who preach hatred of conduits leave us no choice. So who's really to blame here? Maybe you. Whoa. <laughs> that was a nice touch at the end. It just came to me. Huh? What about the part where I put a hole through the hater? Ooh, golden age of television. Oh, man. I got all this energy now. I gotta burn it off. I mean, there's plenty of activists you out there. You wanna hook up? Activists can wait. <laughs> Whoa, whoa, whoa. You know, you want to go someplace where you know, our bodies don't get riddled by ballista and foreplay? Oh. Poor place for the week. <laughs> <laughs> Just wanted to call and say thanks, Dud. Sorry about all those laser blasts at the end there, but it's been, you know, a while since I, uh... Ooh. <laughs> no need to overdo it with the pillow talk. <laughs> but we should overdo it. We should overdo everything. Just a matter of time before those goons take us out. So we gotta carpe the diem, take the bull by the scroat, go for the gold and forge it into matching nipple rings. I'm telling you, we gotta live fast, die young, and take as many dupes with us as we can. No, ma'am. I am coming out of this alive. So are you. Don't bet on him, Miss Sunshine. You know, anytime you want to actually hang around for one of these things... You know, I've been thinking about what you said before. About those ass-gum lifeliners. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and, you know, they're the ones pissing on me now. Maybe it's time to share the pain. Well, hey, when that time comes, I'd love to tag along. Sure. It'll be a date with a death toll. 
I'll give you a call if anything comes up. Man, a plan, and an aerosol can. We don't need you. made the world a little better place. You are one talented son of a gun. Bad. I should get paid for this. Who died of me? Oh, bad move, man. This is gonna be awesome! <laughs> Automatic turrets? That is so cheating!
<laughs> Lady, you are hell on bridges, you know that? So you recognize me? Oh, yeah, yeah. You're the one that had me dead to rights a couple weeks ago and just let me walk away. You've changed since then. You mean the smoke thing? Yeah, that's new. <laughs> I hear you've learned a new trick. You've expanded your arsenal. Well, I don't know where you heard that. I mean, I'm, I'm just a lowly smoke guy. We'll see. Uh, yeah, that's that's doing nothing for me. <laughs> So maybe I, you know, lied about the neon thing, but listen, I think I can save us both a lot of time here. I just need to leech a little power off you, that's it. You want me to just give you my power? I mean, not enough to sink bridges or anything, but enough to pull the concrete daggers out of my friends, yeah. And then after that, you will never see me again. I've got a better idea. Since you'd be useless to me back in your little hovel, how about you stay here with me? Yeah, I kind of like my idea better. <laughs> Dawson. <laughs> you disappoint me. No. Whoa! <laughs> Hold down. Hold down. Okay. My true superpower. Shit. Damn it. Of course. <laughs> Suckers. Hey, Eugene, talk to me, man. What am I looking for in this convoy? I don't know. I mean, they're moving a lot of prisoners, so maybe look for some buses? Whoa, what was that? Uh, helicopters? A whole pack of them. I don't think they can see me in the fog. Come on, just hand over your prisoners, and we'll call it a day. Hey, I got one. I, I, I don't know how, but I, I did.
still be there. Last place to hide. Oh, thanks for the tip. So where'd you disappear to earlier, huh? Hey, maybe conduits don't have to go to the bathroom, but the rest of us do. Where's all this information about what's going on? In, in the Lantern District, the walls have ears and eyes. I just have friends in high places. Sounds like helpful friends. Uh, well, I couldn't imagine better. What? What do you think? I mean, there's a little bit of pain putting on, especially in there. Smells like somebody had some Thai food. But what do you think? Chase me. You want me to chase you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chase me, shoot me. Uh, shoot near me. Near me. And we'll see what happens when one of the angels shows up. Yeah, because I've got a really good batting average with the Angels right now. If they take you, man, they take you to God yeah, knows where. I know. Okay, but look, you know how you're always losing your phone and then you grab mine and find it? Right. Right, well, we have a GPS link. So you're like a big, ugly tracking device, okay? Right, but look, we got to make this look real, okay? Not too real, just real enough to fool the Angels. You get me? Oh, I can get you right between the eyes. No, no, just... Don't be a dick. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Worst idea ever. Oh. What the hell? Woo. I gotta hand it to you, big brother. You make excellent live bait. What? It worked, didn't it? Found the angel conduit slayer, now we go take him out. Come on, you come with me or what? Uh, I'm gonna take this shit off. And I'm gonna go cry myself to sleep. There's gotta be a ton of weird, spiky shit down there, and that, brother, that's all you. Oh my god. Don't walk away, Mad. <laughs> it was your plan. <sighs> It's starting to get old. Oh, it sounded like you were in trouble, so I came running. You yeah. okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Thanks, man. I couldn't have done it without you. Oh, wait, I already did. Speaking of, man, you're not gonna believe what I can do now. As soon as I figure out what it is that I can do. Well, poor thing, she got a kidnapper off the streets. Oh, whoa, whoa, bro, not kidnapper. He's more like a rescuer. Delson, listen to me. He took suspected conduits right off the street yeah. against their will. That's kidnapping. Okay, don't go anywhere. First of all, thank you for using the word conduit. Second of all, why are you being such a dick? Look, fine. Let's just agree to disagree. But we both know it's better for everyone if he goes in a cage. Just hang out for a second. Can I talk to you? I thought you were all about rule of law and not locking up people without due process. Hey, normally, that's what I do. Oh, what, so it just gets thrown out the window whenever it's convenient for you? Is that it? Just put a red wig and an old trench coat on you, start calling you Augustine. <laughs> no, maybe next Halloween. Cool. So, Game Boy and I over there are gonna have a little conversation conduit to conduit. No normals allowed? Fine. If you need me, be right outside, okay? Ellen, thank you for all your help. Couldn't have done it without you. Oh, wait, I you already, already did. did. I know, it wasn't funny the first time. <laughs> so, 
Eugene, my brother, what do you say? You and me, a couple conduits, we hit the town, you teach me some of those video tricks, I teach you how to pick up girls, and we take our power to the people. Well, I'd like to find the Russians that were picking on the suspected conduits and kicking the shit out of them for a change. Dude, I want to party with you. It's a date then, yeah? All right. We will rise up, and we will teach them to accept us. Even if it kills them. Thank God you're here, Reg. I need your help. Wait, wait, slow down. Did you say you lost all of your powers? Yes, I lost all my powers. I, I, I lost smoke, I lost neon, I never even got Listen, video. this is great. This is great news, man. What the hell is this great news? I've got a thousand dupes after me and I've got nothing to go on. Remember, we said we were gonna find a cure for you and this is it. I mean, all that bioterrorist stuff, it's gone. Delson, we can go home now. Go home? Listen, you have given it your best, all right? The tribe knows that, I know that. But it is a miracle you are even still alive. I mean, please, can't we just quit while you're ahead for once? Tell me the truth. If you were me, would you just quit and go home? Absolutely. If I were you. No. So I Wait. don't care if I have to throw rocks. I'm gonna get Augustine. But since I'd rather avoid the whole David and Goliath throwing rocks scenario, I really need your help. Yeah, well, it sounds like you've already made up your mind, so why do you need me? Well, if I'm gonna have any chance of getting any powers back, it's gonna be through one of these core relays. Of course. But, damn it, Reg. I can't crack one of these things without any powers, all right? So I... I don't actually need you. I, I, I need your gun. <laughs> no. No, 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 no. You are not getting my gun, and that is final. You... <laughs> Jeez. But maybe I will let you have a... Couple of my bullets. <laughs> Thanks, man. Okay, Eugene, here's the plan. I'm gonna sneak around to the side. Right? Come on, Eugene, you can do better than this, you conduit stud, you. Here comes Heaven, Hell, and Delson! Open up, it's me! Hey, Delson! What, you move the clubhouse? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm ready. Let's rock and roll, man. Well, no, you're gonna rock and roll. I'm gonna stick to the shadows. What? You know, stealth. Right. Stealth. Eugene, looks like the dupes are joining in. Perfect. It's funny how a little indiscriminate slaughter can make the whole world seem brighter, huh? 
Hey, I made the world a better place. Figure I deserve a victory lap. <laughs> so, where are your friends? Good. Then I need you to help me find something. You know those glowing boxes the dupes put up around town? Uh, sure. Hold on. Hey, there's one not far from you. Awesome. Oh, by the way, I've uh, seen a few of those occurrence around causing trouble. What do you say? I've got an amazing new sword. We could do some damage. How cool is that sword, right? I know, right? So, you interested? No, that, that's okay. I've got level 11 angels waiting for Why do you care about this guy? You already got Smoke. Because I think this might be the guy who was on that transport with you, the one I got my powers from. You mean that big sweaty guy, right? Yes. And if he busted out of Augustine's tower, then maybe he can help me figure out a way to break in. Why don't you come with me and help? No. No, that guy is bad news. I think I'll just, you know, sit back and watch the fireworks. Delson, just watch yourself. I don't trust the ball for that Sure, but I'm not exactly helpless, all right? Besides, you and know, I've got something in common. I've got no love for Augustine. Yeah. Good luck. Reg, what, what are you doing here? Look, those are people over there. They need our help. Not bioterrorists, not conduits. People. Well, thank you. And thank you for, for being here, so. What's Cop doing here? He's my brother, okay? He's, he's here for me. So, what are you thinking? <clears throat> I've been doing some recon. Our best bet's the dock on the far side. It's less exposed. Figure you two can do your smoke gift. Thank and you. Draw their attention out front. I'll commandeer your boat and go in during the distraction. Why are you going in first? Because I'm a cop. Which means I can commandeer a boat and it's legal. You steal a boat, I'm gonna haul your ass in. Oh, he'll do it. Too. Um, so we'll see you inside, right? Yeah, see you inside. Stay safe, boy. What? All of a sudden you don't trust me? I don't know, man. Something's not right. Maybe I should call Reggie. Hank! Henry! You didn't disappoint me. I did like you asked. You just do like you promised. You son of a bitch! I trusted you! Never trust a convict. I see we found something in your size, but just to be sure. Oh, lady. When my brother finds out what you did, oh, he is gonna... He's gonna what? Uh, you could have hit me! Yeah, that's payback for blasting me with the angels. Now come on, get up. Come over here, I'll get those cuffs off you. Sorry, I'm not a grenade. You have to do this the old-fashioned way. What do you mean? Uh, put your hands up here. I'll flinch. Uh. Oh, shit. Where is he? Shut up. 
Dawson. Dawson. Look at me. You gotta let me go. No, I can do this. Listen, can we do can't this. let can this, can this stuff get to you two. Dad, I'm so proud of you. No. Always have been. No. Lindsay, don't. I love you, bro. No! I'm sorry, man. You knew. You told me not to trust Tank, but I didn't listen. But I swear to you, this son of a bitch is gonna pay. You son of a bitch. She killed Reggie. I didn't know, I swear to God. Didn't know. You set us up! Oh, she said she wasn't gonna hurt you! She promised she's just gonna talk! What, and you believed her? Oh, she got a sadistic streak a mile wide, but I never heard tell of her actually killing a conduit. My brother would still be alive if it wasn't for you! She had my daughter. So, any trouble finding the place? I know all about what you did. Using Hank to set up the crash. Making Eugene and Fetch look like monsters to scare the shit out of the city. All so you could swoop in and be the hero. I did what I had to to protect conduits. Protect? You hunt them down. You lock them up. And you train them to kill. I needed Abigail and Eugene to be monsters, because without monsters, the monster hunters go out of business. So that's what this is all about, huh? Job security? And you almost derailed the whole operation. Luckily, you turned out to be the best thing that ever happened to me. You hear them out there? They want your. And once the world sees the head of the D.U.P. saving them from the biggest bioterrorist threat of the last seven years, your death will buy my D.U.P. at least 20 more years of funding. I'm so glad we met when we did. <laughs> Don't be. Oh. oh no. Are you gonna kill me now? You're goddamn right I am. You want my power? You got it. Seven years ago, my unit was there to save lives from a new threat. Conduits. People with powers that no one understood. They had the power to kill.
and the power to transform some of us into conduits, too. I found another survivor. She tailed me as I made my way back to the safety of my battalion. Together, we traveled through a lawless city that wanted us dead because of what we now were. Every day, people joined the lynch mob, horrified by the thought of conduits hiding among them. We'd hurt no one, but they could only see us as monsters. When military order finally asserted itself, they treated us as the threat. I was conduit. I was military. But I couldn't be both. So I made another option. It was the only way. By bringing in that first conduit alive, I'd earned the government's trust. And that was just the start. They funded the creation of the DUP, thinking we were just freaks, hunting down other freaks. But that wasn't it. I was going to save as many conduits as I could. If my kind were going to live, it'd be behind the walls of Curtin K. Seven years, I've kept them safe. Me. I won't let anyone undo that. Not the government. Not the army. Not you. Seven years, all you've done is keep them locked up. You just took away their freedom. So tell me, what would you do? Just throw open the gates at Curtin K Station? Set them all free? You bet your ass I would. The world hasn't changed in the past seven years. Inside, the conduits are safe. They're alive. You turn them out, they'd all be dead inside a week. So tell me, who's the savior? And who's the monster? This is what you wanted. You win. We both have the same power. Only difference is, I've had seven years to practice. I can't catch that! Yeah, I'm told that hurts. Augustine had come to Seattle with a plan. To spread fear, panic, chaos. Make herself out to be a hero. But her plan was soon shattered by monsters she had made. Fetch, Eugene, and me. For two weeks, Augustine had controlled Seattle. Now it was our turn. Who the hell was gonna stop us? Oh, and the hundreds of conduits Augustine had locked away at Curtin K Station? I'm gonna shake each and every one of their hands on their way out the door. So many different powers, all in one place. <laughs> I'll be the kid in the candy store. But first, I had a promise to take care of. Hey, Akomish Nation! Local heroes back home. There's my girl. Whoa, 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 slow down. What? Come back to save the day. The TV news showed everything. 
It showed everything. Okay, look, about I the... saw you kill dozens of innocent people. What did you want me to do? Okay, I wasn't gonna let anybody or anything stop me from getting back to you to, to save everybody. We're a comish. We take care of our own, right? Hey, hey, take it easy. You have disgraced our people. You have disgraced our ancestors. And you have disgraced the memory of your brother. You are a comish no longer. You, everybody else, will die without me. Or have you forgotten that? We haven't forgotten. And we will never forget. But...